What's going on guys and welcome back to the crew. Today I'm taking a look at another one of the new DLC cars. This is the Spiker C8 Aileron. Now this is a vintage car pack meaning, you know, we got some old cars in here. Didn't know this was an old car. It does look like a pretty modern car, so I'm um, a bit surprised about that. But obviously it's in the pack, we're gonna check out this car. Um, you may remember I drove this car in Drive Club, it was my first Drive Club video. Um, so I'm interested to see how this car is in the crew. Looks pretty awesome from what I can tell there. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. Um, the Bird 84 is on, online, um, shout out to him. Just some random guy that I added. Anyway, front bumper, what have we got? That, meh, not a big fan. That looks, I don't like that. I prefer it, like, with the black. Ow, I just hit my hand on my desk. Um, I prefer it with the black grill to the grey grill. Oh, that looks alright. That looks alright. Nah. Nah. There's carbon. There's like, not carbon. Um, chrome bits on here. Do I want to go with those chrome bits? I don't think so. I don't think I do, really. I'm gonna go with that. How's that look? Yeah, let's go with that. Put that. I'm pretty sure that's carbon on there. There. On there, there. Sure, let's go with that. Um, that's a lot of exhaust, four exhaust there. Okay. Um, oh my god. That looks ridiculous and that looks a bit shite. Um, so is that carbon fiber? I think that's carbon fiber. That looks absolutely ridiculous. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure that's carbon fiber. If it isn't, then whatever. Um, fenders, of course. We have nothing. Now I heard that apparently. Um, wait, what's that? That's basically just that, but with... Now we'll keep the we'll keep the carbon one on there. Um, I heard that apparently rims. Some cars have official rims in the um, HQ. So I'm going to probably go to the HQ after this and have a look at those rims. We're going to keep those carbon fiber. No, we're not. No, we're not, we're not going to keep those carbon fiber. It looks a bit shit. Have we got a nice wing? Yes. We need a nice wing. And for the hood, what have we got? Not going to go with a carbon hood. May go with that. Yeah, let's go with that. Alright, now for the colour quickly. Um, oh, actually, I think there's... If I go in uh, to the... the What's it called? I believe I can get some very nice... Um, very nice official colours. So, yes. Um, don't know what I'm going to go with for my colour. So I'm just going to keep that how it is. Um, stickers... I think I can get some stickers there as well. So we're going to go over to the HQ, see what we've got over there. Alright, so here we are at the HQ. What have we got? Colours. Here, yeah, here we go. We've got the official colours. We've even got some metallic colours. So um, I kind of want to remember this from now on. Because, um, yeah. Okay, silver looks pretty cool. Um, yellow, eh. White looks pretty nice. I like that red, that's a very nice red, but our, our, um, our other one was red. Blue looks very nice. I may go with blue. I think I'm going to go with blue. Should I, I'm going to go with blue. Stickers, have we got any stripes? Um, racing, yes we do. Okay, what do we want to go with? Um, just some good old white racing. Oh, the thing is the... the um, the bit of the roof, that's what it's called, is a bit weird. I don't feel like this really goes with it. We may go with it anyway, though, just because why not? It's not going to look any better, like with one down the side, is it? Like that. Nah. I think we'll go with. I think we'll go with that. That looks very nice. We'll put that on there. Interior. Um. What sort of interior do we want? Do we just want to put like a nice grey interior or something? Something like something like that. Maybe even red seats. Red seats with blue goes pretty good. Let's grab that. Oh, well, I didn't know we could change plates. That's that's new for me. Yeah, just stick that on there. Alright, so there we go. That is my Spiker C8 Aileron. I think it looks pretty damn cool. I'm not going to really bother with the rims. Oh, actually, yes I am. What rims have we got? I forgot about the rims. I'm not going to have very long to drive this car. Um... Oh, they look. I'm, a, I'm that sort of rim guy. Yeah, we're gonna go with them. 
So there we go, spike a seed aileron. Let's quickly go out and take it for a drive. Alright, so we're just going to drive around here um, just outside the uh, um, the Perspec Tuna because I can't really be bothered going anywhere else. But we'll, we'll kind of go a different way. So we usually just go straight forward. So we'll kind of go back on ourselves and see where it takes us. So this car looks pretty damn cool. The rear bumper is absolutely insane. Um, it's a pretty insane rear bumper there. Move out my way. Um, and oh, this car looks really cool. This is an awesome looking car. The wing goes really well with it. The colors and the stripes are really awesome. I really do like this car. What does the cockpit view look like? Oh, okay. There's like a chromey sort of interior, chromey dash there with some more big dials. What is it with vintage cars and big dials? We had it on the Corvette C2 last time. Don't know why a lot of vintage cars have giant dials. But you know, I guess it's because people, you know, may maybe a lot of older people drive these cars because they're older cars. But saying that though, at the time it wasn't made for older people. Anyway, I'm gonna shut up now and I'm gonna end the video here guys. So thank you guys very much for watching. If you enjoyed please go ahead like and subscribe. It really means a lot to me. And I will see you guys in the next video.